So I want to show you guys three different body weight upper body exercises and then a simple way to put them in a circuit so you guys can get an awesome upper body workout with almost zero equipment. So let's start with the very first exercise, which is the extended range of motion push-up. So you're going to need a pair of push-up handles, or you can put your hands on some yoga blocks, or even on a pair of chairs. And what you're going to do is push-ups, but you're going to go through an extended range of motion. So I'll show you what that looks like. You're going to bring these down to the ground. You're going to have your hands about, you know, 45 degrees or less right outside your shoulders. And you're going to try to come all the way down, bring your chest all the way to the ground, and back up. So that extended range of motion is going to work your chest harder. It's going to make you look better. It's going to make you perform better as well. Now the next one is a push-up variation that I see very few people doing. It's called the vertical pike push-up. It's a great way to work up to being able to do handstand push-ups in the future. So this is what this one's going to look like. You're going to walk your feet up the wall, come into a vertical pike position, and then you're going to do push-ups just like if you're going to do a handstand push-up. So it looks like this. Hands on the ground, feet up on the wall, I'm in that pike position now. So down, up, down, up, all right? Vertical pike push-ups. And last, is a favorite of everybody's, the pull-up, all right? Builds killer back muscles, killer arm muscles. So good old-fashioned pull-up, you just need a pair of rings or a pull-up bar, or even just a beam to do pull-ups on, and we just do pull-ups. So here's how this workout's gonna do. On the first set, you're gonna get your metrics, you're gonna get your reps. So you're gonna go do one set to almost failure of those extended push-ups. So you might do, you know, 10, 15, whatever, right before you're about to go to failure, pause for a second, rest. Give yourself two reps in the bank that you could do. Rest then. Then walk your feet up the wall. Do a set of vertical pike presses. Same thing. Once you feel like you're going to fail in about two reps, rest. Pull up. Same thing. Once you're about to fail in two reps, rest. And then you can hit that circuit with about 30 to 60 seconds rest between each exercise. And you're going to build an awesome looking upper body that looks good and performs even better. If you guys want to check out my comprehensive upper body system that is being released today, check out the link below. And I'll show you how to build an upper body that looks good and performs even better. Otherwise, thanks so much for watching and good luck with your upper body training.